What up, y'all? It's your girl Snow, the product, and I'm here at K-Swiss. I'm checking out the new Dreamer shoe that K-Swiss is doing in support of Dreamers. And I think it's so awesome to be giving back to a community that loves them as much as we do. I know as a Hispanic person, I wore K-Swiss in high school, so I'm super excited to be here, and um, check it out. K-Swiss, as a brand, has a long history, over 50 years. And throughout these years, we've had a very strong support from the Hispanic community. So for this Hispanic Heritage Month, we wanted to do something very special and meaningful. One of the great things of working here at K-Swiss, within our four walls, we have, we're made up of a diverse group of people, many of whom have a strong representation within the Hispanic community. So we invited Snow the product in to come and take a look at the Dreamer shoe to give us her perspective on what we've done for Hispanic Heritage Month, because she's such a strong and active influencer in the Hispanic community. Uh, on our side, we feel like that brands now should take a take a position on some social issues and say what we really think and yeah. um obviously you as a rapper that's your whole business is telling people what you think yeah. um as a brand it's not our, usually what we're supposed to do but i think yeah. you know now you're seeing more brands doing it and I, and to go back to what you were saying about you know artists there's a lot of artists that that don't say opinions that that try to stay out of certain issues but that's that's just some punk shit you know what i'm saying like at the end of the day like you have to stand for something and if if you if people are giving you their last 20 dollars to to buy you know your item or your music or whatever it is like you, you you owe it to to that fan base or to those people to try to do your best to make the world a little bit better you know what i'm saying so to just be like nah we'll just take the money and y'all can figure out the issues is a little you know like unethical i think it's it's dumb but um so i think i applaud companies that do stand for something or you know or at least if anybody who's willing to take the negative to be able to represent the positive is good in my book yeah you know? you, know, you mentioned that your parents are both immigrants obviously we we've just launched this dreamer pack so you know what is your connection to to the, to the issue of immigration or, or to dreamers you feel that's a personal issue for you yeah definitely i mean i feel like i've i've talked about you know these issues since before they were kind of like in the you know in in on tv because of you know the president and everybody that's kind of it, it kind of has come to everyone's attention a little bit more recently because of negative things that have been said and then people defend it and that's good you know the, the at least having the conversation is good so the classic vn consists of an all-white leather upper with red and blue highlight stripes underneath the five stripes that are comprised of ballistic nylon, just for an added texture and more dimension. The outsole is a white midsole, and then the outsole is actually a clear translucent bottom, revealing a very important message, that we are all dreamers. The ST529, a chunky dad shoe, represents the current trend today. So we outfitted it and applied an outsole that was clear and translucent for an added dimension. The standout feature of the ST529 is the word dreamer applied to the upper. It was purposely applied to read in the direction of the wearer as a call to action, taking a stand to support dreamers. Some of the world's biggest companies have led the way in pushing to publicly protect dreamers. Uh, Microsoft, IBM, Starbucks, Coca-Cola. And so we're just playing a small part in saying, hey, we stand for dreamers and we believe there should be a permanent solution for these 800,000 people that were brought here as kids. And if we can do something to keep the light shone on the issue to make sure it gets resolved, then we're happy to do it. And I think we've created something really meaningful, uh, really beautiful, and that gives back by contributing the proceeds. Half of the proceeds go to United We Dream, and it's something we're, we're, we're very happy to do. I'm super excited about this shoe to come out um, I'm a big fan of the ST329. I wear my black one very often, but something about this shoe really caught my attention. Um, a couple of things that really stood out to me. One is the way that Dreamer is utilizing this shoe. I've seen it now on people and I think it just looks so badass um, the way that it's just designed. And for some reason, I'm really attracted to the little logo on the bottom. Um, I think it's a nice little pop complements the clear soles. As far as the the meaning of the shoe and what we're doing, you know, it's really special to me, I guess, being Hispanic and having family 
um, that would qualify as a dreamer. And I think, you know, that's one of the coolest things about this shoe is not only is it a really cool design, but the message and what it stands for is helping people out. I definitely think it's a bold move. Um, you have a lot of well-known, reputable companies nowadays now doing collaborations with other partnerships or brands or whatever it might be, social issues. And I think it's great that K-Swiss has found something relative to who our original target market is and was able to collaborate and develop and design a shoe behind that. This experience is a really serious subject matter. And every time you know we've brought someone in to help us understand more about it, there's been a lot of fun along the way, having to know the product in the office and getting to know more about her and, and how she gets involved. And this program has brought together so many different components from fashion and music and celebrities, influencers and entertainment and charity. And so I think that while it's a serious topic, it's like we can, at the same time as looking fly, giving back, you know, you can be the total package. I know everyone's looking for like, what is the total package? And I think it is someone who is fly, can give back, you know, loves good music and, and, and can appreciate uh, being a, a dreamer or what a, a dreamer means. So we've, we partnered up with United We Dream, which is a fantastic organization. 50% of the proceeds we make will be donated to, to the organization in order to fund DACA recipients application fee. Um, so if you go to caseless.com, you can find more information about how you can get involved. Thank you.